In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to enter daily sales in QuickBooks Online. So without any further ado, let's get started with today's video. The first step is to access the sales section. So log in into your QuickBooks Online account and navigate to the sales or invoicing section. This is where you can enter and manage your sales transactions. The following step is to create a sales receipt or invoice. So depending on your business and the nature of your sales, you can either create a sales receipt or an invoice. Sales receipts are typically used for immediate payment transactions, while invoices are used for sales where payment will be received at a later date. So creating a sales receipt, click on the option to create a new sales receipt, enter the customer's name and the products or services sold, and the payment methods such as cash, credit card, or check, specify the quantity, rate, and any applicable discounts or taxes. Save the sales receipt when all the relevant details have been entered. Creating an invoice, click on the option to create a new invoice, enter the customer's name and the products or services sold on the payment terms such as due date, payment method, Third, so it's why the quantity rate and any applicable discounts or taxes save the invoice when all the relevant details have been entered. The following step is to review and save the transaction. So review the entered information to ensure accuracy. Double check the customer details, items sold, prices, and any additional charges or discounts. Make any necessary adjustments or collections. When you are satisfied with the transaction details, click on the save or save and close button to save the transaction. Fourth step is to repeat for each day's sales. So repeat the above steps for each day's sales. Create a new sales receipt or invoice for both. Uh, for each separate transaction you want to record. So the last step is to reconcile your sales with payment deposits. Uh, to ensure accurate financial records, reconcile your sales with the payment deposits received in your bank account. Match the deposits and QuickBooks Online with the corresponding sales receipts or invoices to reconcile your records and ensure all transactions are accounted for. So this is how you do it, guys. Thanks for watching.